the letter from the HR department has just come and you are now rushing to invest money to save tax through an ELSS scheme. A familiar story that plays out every year come January. And in the process, a lot of our plans get disrupted. Did you know that you can do a systematic investment plan even in an equity-linked savings scheme or ELSS? These schemes are diversified funds and come with a three-year lock-in. And this is the lowest compared to other tax saving schemes. Moreover, they have delivered far better returns than other financial products. Now an SIP is a disciplined way to invest on a monthly basis. Its biggest advantage is it averages out your cost of buying your mutual fund units. So when the markets are high, you may get a lesser number of units. But when they fall, you accumulate a larger number of units. This works very effectively in volatile markets, the kind we are seeing right now. And remember, markets will always go up and down and rarely stay in a straight line. The other big advantage is discipline, as it forces us to invest regularly and not get all lazy about it. Every month, a certain amount is deducted from our bank account and moved to the mutual fund scheme. Now, if you earn monthly, are you not better off spending monthly as well? An ELSS fund allows us to invest one and a half lakh rupees every year to get a tax deduction under Section 80C. Now, if you were to simply do a 12 and a half thousand rupee SIP every month, you would reach your annual limit and not have to run around at the last minute. And in fact, this could continue for years in a seamless manner without having to make any changes. Now you know, Mutual Fund Q segment. Mutual Fund investments are subject to market risks. Read all scheme-related documents carefully.